I'm just gonna throw this out here one more time. Pig Supreme. Oh, golly. Now you're just beating a dead horse. Hey. Sorry. Look, I don't come across many words in the field other than, yeah, or giddy up. But that rat's always dragging in trash with writing on it. I agree. It's about time Templeton started pulling his weight around here instead of just eating it. I bet he could bring us some choice words. I got a choice word for you. A little word called, uh-uh. Well, that's two words. And here's a few more. Negative. No way, nothing doing. I ain't breaking my back to try and save some pig, no matter how terrific you think the little lunch meat is. <laughs> You'll sing a different tune when he's gone and nobody brings around those scrumptious buckets of slop. And three, two, cue the rat. Let's get one thing straight. I don't care about the pig. What I care about is the slop. Of course. And since I'll be at the dump anyway, and it won't take any extra effort, maybe, maybe I'll pick something up. You're very kind. Don't go spreading it around. What? What do you want? You'll need your strength. Oh. Thanks. But Dad, I heard them. I heard them talking about the smokehouse. He's not your pig anymore. Well, I wouldn't have sold him in the first place if I knew this is what they were going to do to him. That's what happens to a pig on a farm, Fern. You know that. I'll see about that. Maybe two, three years before she can out-argue me. Then I'm doomed. And members of our own 4-H club will have the opportunity to enter livestock and poultry in the competition. So, in addition to the rides and games, make sure you show them your support as well. Any questions? Rita. Miss Lewis, can I bring my chickens? Your chickens, I'm sure. Pigs, chickens, horses, and cows. You certainly can. And I hope you win first prize. 